Hello, all you space engineers. Commander Kingfish here, and it is day eight here on planet 26. Well, the last episode, we ended up working on the power structure, and we've got that to that point right there. And so I think we've got power for now. And so what I uh, am planning on doing I just got to keep an eye on these guys I don't think they will bother me as long as I don't bother them and if I stay away from their area for now uh, so the only thing that's got me worried is that cobalt field and I'm going to be somewhat close to that uh, ore processing outpost but hopefully I can uh, get get close enough to it to get the cobalt and maybe salvage some stuff down there uh, so what I wanted to do today though is last episode I had gotten that uh, the power situated pretty good and I started running out of nickel and silicon so I put in a, like a gravel processing uh, plant or resource node and so I've got gravel coming into here I've already pulled some out, so we've got some more. Let me grab this, and uh, we can throw this over here into the refinery and try to get some of those resources back. Since the actual nickel and uh, silicon uh, ore deposits, they're quite a ways away. And, and the magnesium deposit is quite a ways away. So I've got to start working with stone to get those resources at least until I can kind of get the refinery built up. So what I'm going to do today is work on getting a refinery built and getting a refinery built and a gravel sifter built so in essence what will what in the world boy I just got they're just all over the place here as long as he stays up there I think as long as they don't get too close then I'm okay uh, another transport it's a ways away it's got escort drones with it so I'm going to build out uh, a start building out uh, a refinery right here and then a gravel sister and I'm going to try to sort that to where it's only pulling er all the resources in from there over to the refinery and then uh, it's not pushing any of the refined stuff back in I'm going to build another another uh, cargo bin for all the refined ores so that the ingots will go into there and I'm going to use sorters for that so if we can see if we can get get that to, to work so once I uh, get some a uh, little farther along on that I will uh, catch back up with you all all right just to kind of give you an update on what I've got going here so my refinery is going to be right here I'm using an industrial refinery which uh, does lead to a few problems uh, but what I've done over here is I've put in piping that's going to come from this cargo bin it'll come down uh, and follow along over here I've put a sorter in here because I only want the raw materials to come in through from there over to here I don't want it uh, I don't want the refinery putting finished ingots back that way so this is going to be so this sorter is just basically a one-way uh, one way in and then what I've done over here now I've got to figure this out this is a one-way sorter obviously and I only want uh, gravel to come into here because this is my gravel sifter 
so what I will have is a another pipe coming out on this side for the finished uh, ingots and then I'm going to set up a probably a cargo bin somewhere around right in here to where the finished ingots coming out of here will come in and uh, come out into the cargo bin <coughs> what I might have to do is put a another sorter in right here I'm not sure uh, to keep the to make sure that the finished ingots uh, only come this way and and don't come through here uh, I'm going to whitelist uh, gravel and then try to blacklist everything else uh, so this is just purely refining of ores so I shouldn't have any other types of materials coming through here so anyway that's where we're at right now let me get started building on this stuff and then uh, we'll see how that's all working out I am getting stone I have been moving stone over so I should at least have uh, materials to be able to kind of build this without uh, being stuck so I'll uh, catch back up with you all here in just a little bit All right, I think I'm about to bring this gravel sifter online. So let's let's see what it can do for us as far as getting some of those resources. So here's the gravel. It should start uh, refining it down. So we're going to get a little magnesium out of it. Uh, some more nickel and so yeah every little bit helps it's going to continue to refine on that so we can let's grab this and that and the rest of that stuff it could just sit there and uh, grind away it's not uh, I mean we're getting rid of the gravel which we don't really need and uh, we're able to at least get some more resources out of it especially nickel I didn't realize how much I was going to need nickel till I couldn't can't get it it's a uh, scattered way off we'll have to do another reconnaissance for it at some point uh, but it's a little ways away but I think the next reconnaissance I know where the cobalt is and if I need it I can go get it but uh, now that should get sucked in. There we go. So I guess what that gravel sifter does, it refines it down into ore. So I might have to rethink my process here. I was thinking it refined it down into ingots, but it's refining it into ore. So I might need to... I wonder, since this is refining it down into ore, uh, if I send it, what if, I don't know how this will work, we'll have to try it. I'm thinking I can, uh, pipe this back into the refinery and I think there's an outlet up above but let's see if we can get this refinery up and running well I need to kind of try to finish these off so that we have connections all the way over to here so let's uh, I need motors 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 more motors all right. Well, I'll tell you what. Let me get to building some more on this. And uh, I, once I get a little farther along, I'll catch back up with you in a little bit. And we'll, we'll see how this refining process is going to work. All right. See you in a little bit. Okay. Well, I'm making some progress here. Uh, I've 
I got this all done coming in over to here. I've got the refinery done and this is done. And I uh, took a look. Uh, hold on here. I think I pulled in. All right, let's go over here. Let's come down to the, okay, here's the refinery and it's pulling in the iron. Now let's see what I got. I still have some stone. Let's drop some stone in there. And so it's processing the stone. If we come back up to the gravel sifter and now it's, it's processing that gravel and, and uh, bringing in more components there. So, if we do this, we'll grab the nickel and the silicon. Alright, so we've got that loop. And I set this up on a white list. So, I, I'm hoping that this is going to just only allow gravel to come through here. And, uh, we can uh, then, then what I'm need to do next is get this cargo bay set because I've got uh, this sorter right here which will only allow ores to come through. That way I, I can have all my processed ingots come in through here. So this is the next thing I've kind of got to get set up and in through here. Uh, and, I, and I think what I'll do is blacklist gravel and stone so that that will not pass uh, ores might pass through I might have to deal with that a little bit later but now that this is starting to process out of that cargo bay I'm thinking that that's going to catch up with that and then we're not going to end up filling up this cargo bin so, uh, that's where we're at right now. Let me get, uh, get this next step uh, put in. We'll get the lines running over and get that cargo bin done. And then hopefully we will start to be able to uh, get this uh, production facility started. At least a basic production facility. Alright, I'll catch back up with you here in just a little bit. Okay, well, I think I've got some progress made here. Uh, I think I've got the this production facility put into a point that it's at least functioning somewhat what I want it to do. Now, with the cargo bay in, with the cargo bay in here, we can see that uh, right now it's filling up with iron and that the refinery is processing iron so it st should start putting a bunch out through here now let's see if I can grab I can uh, that's what I needed to be able to do was grab that nickel because I had kind of blocked myself out from over here Come on, get up there, jump. The way I had this set up, I couldn't pull the nickel down through here because I have this set up to only allow gravel, uh, which is what I want. Now, my next step and my kind of last step today is uh, I want to see if I can loop this back into the refinery. Uh, this stuff. The ice won't go through. I'll have to pull the ice out from time to time. And that's okay. That's not a big deal. I can do that. Uh, but I want to be able to send this back through over, over to the refinery. So I'm going to have to run piping out of the top and I think up to the top of the refinery. I think first what I'll try to do is run it from here over to see if I can pull 
see if it will pull it back in through there because it's not going to allow ores to come in through here I've got this uh, my blacklist is gravel stone and ore so that uh, none of that will pass through the ore will be processed so none of the ores will come through so all of that uh, anything that's coming in to that cargo bin over here can't get through without being processed and so let me let me see what I can do about getting this set up to do a, f a loop through here uh, what do I got on me uh, oh I do have some interior plates uh, let's see I think the first thing I got to do is well, I got to be able to get to the top of that I wonder if we do it like this we'll lay down some blocks we'll lay a block here and Let's see, if we put a block there. Let's see if we can put a block here. Let's see if that'll allow me to get up. Okay. So I think what I need to do is, let's go five. Actually, I, I need to change the color doing all of those in black and then actually six uh, all right let's put that right there And then we need a pipe uh, coming out of there. Uh, all right, let's see here. Can we get that to connect up there? Uh, that's okay. I think that's what I want right there. And then I need to get back up here. We need to put that right there. And then that should connect right there. So Energy low. Let's uh, get what we need. Can I reach it? There we go. There we go. All right. And that's about good timing. Uh, so I've made some progress so far today. Uh, let's see what we can grab. Do I have anything to... Yeah, I can put that in there. Alright, let's go build this out. Or at least build out what I can on it. Let's come up here. Oh, I forgot to get energy. All right, that's completed. That one's done. Oh, I need motors. Motors and motors. All right, which is not surprising. That's what I've been needing the nickel for. So hopefully, though, I've gotten gotten to the point of being able to start allowing the nickel to start flowing through or allowing the stone to th flow through 
Let's see if we've got some more motors made. All right, down to five motors. All right, I think we should have everything. Hopefully, now this is going to create that loop back in. Otherwise, I'm going to have to go to the top of the refinery. So if this doesn't work, then I'll have to redo redo this. All right, we get you done. That one done. Get that done. Okay. Let's see. Well, first off, let's go to the refinery. It will allow that to come through. We can process. We can put the nickel in there. So I guess it's just a matter of the priority. Once it will go through, the other option I could put on there was would be a, another sorter. So let's see how that's going to work. I mean, it, it does allow me to put it back through, and I could just probably either do that manually every so often. But that should allow... Let's get over here. Go to here. Actually, let's do this. Refinery. At a minimum, I can grab what I need out of here. I can move it over. I can grab what whatever I need. Grab that, grab that, that. Grab that iron. So that is, yeah, I think we're kind of, oh, yeah, no, no access there, no production. All right, let's come over here. Throw this in. Put that there, that there, that there, that there. And then it should pull it in as it's needed. Well, I th think I'm going to probably call the video pretty good for today. We've I've managed to get the uh, refinery facility somewhat set up to what I want. Uh, what I ideally what I wanted was everything to come in everything to come into this cargo bay from the iron and the stone and then it'll get pulled in through to the refinery to be processed. And then the ingots will come in, the processed ingots will come in over to this cargo bay. The stone that's being processed, the excess gravel will come into here and then it should oh actually you know what uh looks like the refinery did pull all of that in let's go down to the refinery yeah there it is it did pull all of that in beautiful that's exactly what i wanted excellent so that's looping back through back into the refinery and then once it's processed into a, a good ingot, it's coming over here. So I think next time... Uh, I need to... Finish... Well, I think I want to finish... I probably at some point need to put in an assembler. But mainly, I wanted to get this, this portion of this done. 
Uh, so I think next time, though, I need to figure out how to get to magnesium. So I think what we're going to probably do is go off on a trip uh, in the next episode to see if we can find that magnesium, which is probably about 20 miles away, I think. So it's going to be a bit of a jaunt, and who knows what kind of uh, problems we're going to run into. Let's see, so the uranium is... Uh, let me kind of figure out where we're at here. Uh, respawn. There's the uranium mine. The uranium mine is that way. And... The iron is that way. Which means the magnesium, according to the map, should be at my back, which should be out in that direction somewhat. So hopefully we can find that. There's also supposedly a gold field out there, so we might try to find that gold field as well. Okay, well, the sun's coming up. So I think this is a perfect time to uh, call it good. That's what we got. We got our plan set for the next video on what we're going to do. We're going to go after magnesium and maybe find some gold along the way. And uh, uh, see if we can't get a, uh, a magnesium production facility up and processing. And we just got to figure out how to get it here. Okay, all you space engineers out there. Uh, if you like this uh, video please hit that thumbs up. It really helps the video out a lot. And please subscribe. That really helps the channel. All right, all you space engineers out there, uh, keep your heads low, keep building away, don't get shot. And with that, Commander Kingfish is out of here, and I will see you all in the next video. Thanks for watching, everyone.